Hey everyone, it's the She Got Shadow here, and I just wanted to give you an update of what's going on with my twists after five weeks. Very happy to see that they are holding up very well. I have to say that she used a very um, good quality of hair. Don't know the brand name of the hair. She provided the hair, and she used quite a bit of it. I don't even know how many packs in full. Um, that she used but I just wanted to talk a little bit about what I noticed with my edges I was very concerned about the edges um, they haven't been compromised too much um, as you can see after five weeks it doesn't look so bad what I do is take a toothbrush and I will select them um, up and around so it doesn't look so unkempt but I am very pleased with the fact that I have minimal itching I've been using tea tree and tea tree oil and I've been using jojoba oil and coconut oil and just putting it down inside um, the scalp area so I you know, have minimal itching um, but then again my hair I am sweating from time to time it's not very hot because it's now going into the winter months however I still sweat in my scalp area at night I will wrap my hair with a silk scarf around here and then take the hair and put it under a silk satin bonnet so during the night I'm having some sweating so without my hair being washed for five weeks yes that can be an issue with my scalp you know having a little bit of um, a smell because it has not been washed. I'm not going to wash my hair. I'm going to try to rock this out for another three or four weeks, five weeks maximum. I cannot imagine me having this in any more than two months. Um, but yeah, just wanted to show y'all and I'll just show you the back how it looks after the five weeks. And I am very, very pleased, like I said, with the results and how she did my hair. She did a wonderful job. Took her five hours. It was two women, um, primarily uh, the lady who did all of the roots down to about here. And then the other lady would just finish the ends. So, um, yeah, I'll probably get this again right before my birthday. When I go out of town, I don't want to have to really do anything to my hair. So this would be ideal. My birthday's in April, so it should work out real nice. Once I take these out, beginning of January, um, it'll be a good three months wearing my hair out, and then I'll get them again. So, yeah, that's what's going on. But, yeah, I'm just, you know, I was very worried before I got this about my edges. I remember a couple of times I had my hair braided many years ago, and my edges, I was just always concerned that my edges would be compromised. And here, yeah not that compromised so very pleased about that two thumbs up um, my face of the day I'll show y'all some pictures at the end just a little bit of purple and um, I used a couple of my MAC pigments that I've had for years and I just don't use so I was like let me just do something real quick today um, I really love the way it came out um, pink lip even though we're in December I'm not really into a lot of Christmas colors right now uh, still love this mm. please me color by Mac and my lip liner that I use is the NARS and basically this is pretty much what the color looks like and I have that all around my lip line so um, y'all yeah, basically have pictures at the end and hopefully everyone's having a wonderful holiday season with your family and friends. Hope everyone is staying um, warm in the colder states. I'm in Florida, so I'm good. <laughs> um, but until next time, I want to say love and blessings and happy holidays.